This is the Spectre from Spec5. It is an all-in-one turnkey solution for a mesh-tastic node that you carry with you. And that's the size of it right there. So let's talk about that today. I went to MeshCon in October of 2024 down at the Spec5 facility. And it was a good, it was a small event. It was some um, good information, and it was the, but it was the first year they did it. And I hope they do it again. Since then, I've had Daniel from Spec5 on the live stream. And he talked to us about a lot of stuff that Spec5 is working on. Spec5 is a manufacturer. They take existing mesh-tastic devices, build cases for them, build systems for them, and that kind of thing. And they're working on some new firmware as well. So this is the Spec5 Spectre. You can see how um, this is my 3x3 patch here that I've got. And my Android smartphone is right here. So I've got it zoomed in pretty close so you guys can see it a little bit better. We'll get some more close-ups of it. You can see that's basically a Held Tech uh, V3 case that's inside of there. This is the two buttons on the bottom of the case right there that push buttons on the uh, the actual board. And then on top of it is an Android. I don't even know what kind of Android device this is, but this is an Android. This is a full smartphone from Android. It's a full smartphone from Android. We can turn this on here and go there. It's got the Meshtastic application right there pre-installed i didn't put this in so you see you see right there it's, it's called s5 spectre of course you can rename that anything you want to you can rename the short name region is us that's the qr code that you can scan to join a room create a customized room whatnot it's got a map right there of course these are other nodes that it's seeing right now this right here this was from several days ago that that's my truck node though is what that is that's a, it's another spec 5 it's uh, called a spec 5 um Beacon, I think, is what I have in my truck right now. It's got a small solar panel on it. We'll do another video about that soon. And then, of course, we've got the long, fast room there. And I need to add our, my customized rooms to it, but I haven't done that yet. So we can go back here to the main menu. It's got these Checktastic. Now, these are applications that have been developed by Spec5, and they're games you can play. So you've got Mesh uh, Chess. Check Tastic, so I think it's Checkers, and then Spec 5 Mesh Tastic, something right there. What does that say? There's different games you can play over the mesh to, you know, just kind of keep yourself entertained and whatnot. So kind of some some cool proprietary, it's not proprietary necessarily, but Spec 5 did write the applications for all that. And then we got your settings and gallery whatnot. Camera, calendar, file manager, got Chrome. I put Chrome on there. There's my photo, the Play Store. You can download anything from the Play Store you want to. So there's my photos right there. I haven't connected that yet. That's fine. I haven't really done much with this yet. But a couple of the guys I know who had this, uh, someone put WinLink on it, which I thought was a good idea. You could put APRS Droid on it. You can use it for, you can put various ham radio type applications on this, and it'll be a good addition to your pack or to just your, your EDC carry that will enable Meshtastic, but also have other ham radio type applications on it. There's the buttons, up down buttons on it for the volume and whatnot. The one drawback about it that I will say is that it has two charge ports for it. So you charge the phone and the Meshtastic board back here independently. They are both USB-C, so you can charge them via the same cable, but they're charging one at a time. So you might want to look for some sort of splitter cable that has two USB-C ports on it where you can charge everything at the same time. But just because you charge the phone up doesn't mean you're charging the Meshtastic radio. So that's that's one kind of drawback, I think, you know, for it kind of like that. I don't know. They've got this cut out here because the camera is usable on the phone. This is your power, power button and uh, screen on off button. And it's just, and of course it comes with this SMA antenna that you can change out. You can put a longer antenna on it. You can put an external mag mount on your vehicle and hook it up that way. I have an external mag mount on my vehicle, but I have another radio that I use for that right now. Today's video is sponsored by PCBWay.com. PCBWay lets you print custom printing for circuit boards, CNC machined products, CNC injection molding, and professional 3D printing. If you need to get any print cases printed, you want to come up with something yourself and get it printed for your Meshtastic device of any design in any nature, head over to PCBWay.com. Check out their many, many options of different types of 
material as far as PETG or PSA or PLA or all the different 3D type printing materials. I don't know them all. But check out, they have everything that you can need. Check out PCBWay.com and tell them that Ham Radio 2.0 sent you. The antenna, the, the antenna that sticks out is a little bit like, it's so small that you're, you're tempted to put it in your pocket when you're walking around places. And if you look, you can kind of see the antenna's little bent right there because I put it in my pocket and the antenna got bent. So take the antenna off if you want to put it in your pocket or just don't put it in your pocket. I do wish it had some sort of belt clip or maybe some sort of molly case for it. There might be a molly case you can find that you can put that in and stick it as a clip on the back of your, your backpack or your go bag or your, your man pack or whatever, something like that. So that's one, another drawback, two drawbacks with it that I've found is that it's independent charging of the phone and the Meshtastic device. The phone itself is small, so it has a small battery. This battery will last about a day Okay. And then, you know, for what it is, that's not bad. It's not bad for what it is. It's not great. I mean, you know, my, my, um, I was going to show you my, the, this is my Z Fold 4. So that's how much smaller it is than the Z Fold 4. In fact, it's even smaller with the antenna than my Z Fold 4 is. So it's small, it's lightweight, it's compact, it's full Android. I forget, I even forget what, um, version of Android it's running. Let's look at that real quick. So this is running Android 9. I kind of thought it was in a newer version of Android than that. It's, it's running a custom build called Servo, and it's on V1.0.2023.12.15 Servo. So it's probably it actually probably needs to be updated because that's from December of last year. So there might be an update for it. I'll have to check that later. But it is Android 9. So I was... I thought it was Android 12, honestly. I thought that's what it was, but it's, it's just Android 9. But I don't know if the version of Android is older because this is an older device or and maybe you can update it i don't know i don't know if the the memory on this device i don't know if it'll justify a newer version of android but um i mean the long and short of it is just don't put any personal information on this okay put uh, create yourself a new google account with a play store access something that's random that doesn't have all the rest of your google stuff download and install whatever apps you want to on this and use it just for a ham radio off-grid device to use WinLink, APRS Droid. It's got Bluetooth, so you can connect it to like a MobiLink TNC or the, DC, the Kenwood D75 that has a built-in TNC, and you can use uh, APRS Droid with that. In fact, that might be a fun video. I might try to do something like that soon. And it's just, it's a very, like I said, it was an all-inclusive, all just turnkey solution for Meshtastic right there. Spec 5 is the company, Spectre is the name of the device. I will put a link in the description below for that. So go check that out and thanks for watching today.